For nearly a year, we followed the effort to move the historic yellow house in Howland. Now the same woman who helped save it is working to save another one in Trumbull County. With the details, here's First News anchor Stan Boney. This is Mahoning Avenue in Champion, just outside of Warren. That's the Route 82 bypass that you see behind me. Over my other shoulder is the Harper House. It was built in 1840 and for a while served as the world headquarters of Copper Weld Steel. Now, Cindy Mines, who has worked to save historic homes in Trumbull County, is trying to make sure that she can save this one too. It is a historic home and I was concerned about what they were doing. What it appears that they're doing is demolishing an addition to the house, added on by Copperweld in the 1940s as a conference room. An official with the Trumbull County Building Inspector's Office did confirm that the current owner of the house and adjoining property, Warren Steel Holdings, has a permit to demolish what's there. The interior, the last time I was in, seven years ago or so, uh, was in a mess, but that just needs cleaned up. The bones are good. We are just ecstatic. Last year, Cindy Mines led the effort to save Holland's historic yellow house, which also was scheduled to be demolished. It has since been moved to a safe location. It is really um, in decent shape. Now Mines is working to save the Harper house, where the front is covered with trees and bushes. Mines says the frame is original, along with the two fireplaces, the layout, and the decorative pieces under the roof line, which are wooden acorns. Well, I personally would like something like a restaurant or something. I just, you don't know what it could become if you demo it. Um, if there's lots of options out there that if people with the vision and um, a caring heart could do something with it. We were able to track down a phone number with someone possibly linked to Warren Steel Holdings. We tried calling them, left a message, and have not heard back. In Champion, Stan Boney, WKBN 27 First News. Hi everyone, I'm Lindsay Watson. Thanks for watching the WKBN 27 First News YouTube channel. If you want more video news, subscribe to our channel and don't forget to download the WKBN 27 First News app for breaking news alerts.